Fort Bend County Libraries has some exciting news for us this week. We've recently added the Access Video On Demand online streaming service, so we're very excited to offer it. There's two different collections in this streaming service. One is for adults and one's for children. To get to it on our website, you would just go to eLibrary and scroll down to TV and, and movies. Inside the library, you don't need a library card, but if you access it from outside the library, you do need a library card. It's not necessary to set up an account to use it, but if you do, you can create a playlist or if you start a movie, you can pick up where you left off again. For the adults, um, we have all kinds of offerings, some from HBO, some from BBC. There's documentaries, independent movies, some are entertainment, some are DIY, just thousands of different options. And they're always available. There's no waiting, there's no um, overdue fees. They're always available. This means I can finally watch the series Chernobyl without paying for HBO or I can watch BBC science programs without yet another streaming service. For the kids, it's a little bit the same thing. You have a lot of entertainment, like Berenstain Bears, or there's also educational. So if you're looking for any kind of documentaries, teaching videos about math or science, we have all kinds of PBS offerings, National Geographic. Um, so, and it's also useful for teachers also because it's, we have public performance rides. So the teachers can use these videos in their classroom. And if the students are working on a research paper, they can pull clips from the different videos. And it also has a citation tool to help them fix, do their citations. As after the, the pandemic, we were closed for a period of time. And then in, on March 15th, we opened five of our libraries. And as of June 4th, we are opening an additional five libraries. So we'll have all 10 of, 10 of our libraries open. The libraries opening in June are Fullshire, First Colony, Sugarland, Mission Bend, and the Mamie George branch here in Stafford. Now, curbside service will continue at all of our locations. The fines and fees will start accruing again. So if anybody had fines that were, were accrued prior to our closing, go ahead and get your books turned in as soon as possible because as of June 4th, we'll start charging fines and fees for overdue books. Um, also with the June 4th reopening, we'll be able to um, accept book donations again. That's been a big question that we've been asked quite a bit. For Stafford CSI, this is Randall Williams.